<laughs> All right, starting out Town City. Game one, Busters Unlimited and Dumps are the Cat. So Alex D is a very strong nest man to see. While Cholin only pulls out for nest, his nest for counter plays. Mm -hmm. So, um, so we'll probably be seeing Alex taking the lead on this one. Definitely. Seems he's opting to take on the Cloud rather than the Sheik. Definitely, that is a very good strategy against this particular team comp. Sheik mm -hmm. alone, although very safe, has very struggles a lot with killing. While Cloud. Um, he has some very strong moves that are very good at killing, but are traditionally a bit more unsafe. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's part of what makes this team competition so powerful, is that they cover each other's strengths and help each other's weaknesses. Yep, needles coming out right there. Help each other's strengths, cover each other's weaknesses. There we go. <laughs> Back there, almost taking the first stock. So, that's why Alex going up against trying to take out the cloud early is a very good idea. Mm -hmm. Rule number one, be quick, clear, and concise. I'm very bad at that. No worries. Alright, Sheik at a very high percent. That was probably a kill percent about 60% ago. Good good option for throwing out the forward air. Um, out with Steve. Taking Sammy's stock. Ooh. Sammy's first stock. Good cross slash combo, dealing some heavy damage. Jolin doing a very good job of stock taking. He's only at 86% on his third stock. On his first stock, sorry. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, uh, Alex D not afraid to go in. Oh. And as I'm complimenting their abilities to stay alive, they both died. Yeah. Sheik surprisingly staying alive at 150. That's what I said, man. She's so safe. It's a missed opportunity right there. Should have been a back throw. That's something, that's something that's really hard to double, is constantly knowing what the what percent everybody's at. Mm -hmm. Although, I don't know. Yeah, he was probably doing the down throw to try and get a combo going, and then <laughs> the uh, knockback was way too much. And he realized. But he went and got the second grab, though. He knew what to do next time. Buster's eliminated in the lead, but Cloud at a very high percent, being saved by the needles. Smart stuff. That's it. Back uh, throw. Confirmed kill. The classicness. The clean grab and back. Very high tech skill. Ness known for being one of the more difficult players in the characters in this game to play. Mm -hmm. This Cloud's just throwing hitboxes out everywhere. It's doing work. Oh, ooh, just missing that throw combo. <laughs> anyway. Back to the match. It's unfortunate that the best commentators for doubles are both playing. Both the teams are playing right now. Mm -hmm. Good stuff from Busters Unlimited, just taking it out. Alex in a really tough spot here. Mm -hmm. Although, this is Smash 4, and that is a cloud, so it's totally possible that he could die very early. Mm -hmm. He can potentials there. Great and there goes their stock tank. Very close to the blast one there, but Alex is staying alive. Mm -hmm. Alex just struggling to hit the ground. And then as I say that, the platforms go away. <laughs> that was, um, anyway. Both teammates just trying to look for a setup into the crowd, uh, crowd cloud, <laughs> uh, cross lounge. <gasps> Solid comeback from Alex so far. Alex D is so strong in the 2v1 situations. As we saw in the last game, he he brought it all the way back when he was down against two resident sleepers. Finally managing his hands on that cheek. <gasps> Gets punished for that whiffed uh, PK Thunder. It's a good thing he's up against Sheik and not somebody who can actually kill. Yeah, both characters at kill percent. 
waiting for the air dodge, but it sidestepped it. Just using the needles to zone him right now. <gasps> Almost killed. Not quite. Messed with rage. Just so, so crazy. Just, yep, air taking game one. Cover her. Don't throw Very the cat. Very smart by Alex. You feel like helmets hitting Lancel? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very unfortunate that we couldn't provide better commentary for my partner is trying to escape me. <laughs> this is, I I don't hate you. It's just I'm so <laughs> bad at this. I'm not. I don't like doubles. Suffer with me. <laughs> okay, I'll suffer with you. All right. Looks like Cholin's sticking with Ness. Usually Cholin and Alex are very quick to ban Lilat, but mm -hmm. it, now they, it seems like they're really thinking about their ban. Well, it's very rare that you'll see a Cloud go Well, I say that, but Clouds go to Lilat. I think it's Mewtwo King's favorite stage to go to. It definitely doesn't hurt Cloud that much uh, when he's on stage. It mm -hmm. can hurt his recovery, but as far as what goes on in Cloud's neutral game, it, in fact, it can actually help him when he's hit to the stage. Yeah, you have to just trade off between recovery and platform. Up air strings. Alright, here we go. Game 2 on Dreamland. Tolan switching to Bayonetta. Seems neither team is, uh, or at least Buster's Unlimited is, isn't worried about getting pineapples. That's probably unlikely a Sheik. Oh, um, another reason why they. Team Buster's Unlimited really likes Triplats because it helps them use their, like, conversion be better. Mm -hmm. And also, they would prefer Dream Knight over Battlefield because of the lower ceiling. Oh, okay. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm back. Texting snipers in the house. What's up? <laughs> I'm still with you. Anyway, uh, so what's the set count right now? Uh, it's 1 0 for Don't Throw the Cat. Okay. Don't throw the cat, definitely putting in work this time. Uh, I can already see they've got the lead against Buster's Unlimited here. Oh, Comtair's Curse. Yeah, I said <laughs> that. And then, uh, yeah. That's Sammy making up for that early stock lost. Seems like we're getting a repeat of uh, Sheik stock tanking That's like last game. Good wish time. How did I say that? Right there. PK, <laughs> she got the, the limit side me on the PK fire. That's a new one. Alex Fairness. Not smart. Getting punished for that Nair on shield. Hmm. Fat within blocking some of the cross slash hits. Not all of them. And red team really getting control with these team combos. I like what I'm seeing. That's the third stock Sammy's taking with his up smash. It's a solid uh, option. Looks like it's working out for him. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Oh, I think Sammy did not know he had limit charge and he accidentally spent it. That's unfortunate. Mm -hmm. Oh, good spike, but uh, it was a low percent, so it didn't kill. And not quite there yet, but Buster's Unlimited is making a strong showing in this game, too. It's 20 bucks. Sorry, I'm just telling my friends to come further. Alright, uh, yellow team trying to regain stage oh. control. Alex avoids getting punished for that uh, unsafe recovery. Yeah. Things are looking good for Red Team here, as long as nothing horrible happens in the next few seconds. Good trade on that down smash. It didn't work. <laughs> My commentator's curse is gone. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are again. And there we go. In yep. the 1v2, but this time Buster's Unlimited takes it. Saw that one coming from a mile away. <laughs> Hard to avoid, unfortunately. Yeah, in game one, actually, uh, Alex managed to take the 1v2. Really? Mm-hmm. Impressive. 
Oh, looks like we got double nest coming up here. Going back to what worked for them in game one, even oh, though Tolan oh, okay. still died in that one. Interesting. So they had double nest game one, huh? Well, let's see if it'll work out for them one more time. Going to smash all this time instead of Town and City. Oh, that's probably because of DSR. <laughs> Cholin content to stay back throwing PK fires. Let's throw PK fires. Trademark. Good cover for the cloud to charge limit. Until the Nesses are trying to get a 2v1 situation on somebody here, but uh, the other teammates is always coming in to save them. And oh, I thought that was going to be a back air cut off the side early. Teammates helping each other out mid combo. She keeps losing that early trade. Sam spending the limits uh, to stall a side B. Pretty smart, but uh, at the end of the day, it's still costing the limit. Good catch with that up here. Plus, just the limit takes the lead by a stock. Yeah, then you really need to take care of Sammy fast. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that would have been cool. And the up air is going to seal it. Ness does have a big head. Yes, <laughs> yes he does. And so we're back to about even half yeah, percent. <laughs> Double down throw. Acting like a conveyor belt with a down throw to fair. Good dash attack punishing for that grab. Well, Joel putting in some work uh, with the team combos with Alex. Here comes another one. Yes, sir. He's going to put up some nice damage for Sammy. Oh, but the side B to catch Alex in the double jump. Very smart. Oh, but Alex answering right back. Good edge guard. Yeah, the messes are going to need to take care of, of uh, take advantage of Cloud's uh, poor recovery. Mm -hmm. Same man should get off that platform safely. With a good chunk of his limit charged. Standard nest combos coming in. Oh, it's PK Thunder to extend the combo. I like it. Buster's unlimited down to their last stocks. And so is Don't Throw the Cat. Things are about even here with Yo having a slight advantage. Yeah, as long as Sammy can stay alive with that yes. high percent. Gonna be forced to burn limit here. Oh, but Daniel doing a number on Alex. Oh, and he catches him with the PK Thunder, but it doesn't kill. Yep, too early. The Fires at him again, up. and this time it's gonna cost him. Cholin in a 2v1 situation. Gets a back air, but that's not quite gonna do it. He was on the wrong side of the stage. And yeah, the problem is once limit goes online, that finishing touch is an option. And there we go. Tried and true. Yep. Hard to avoid that if you can't, if you uh, get grabbed. So Buster's Unlimited takes game three, going up, uh, making the set count 2-1 in their favor. But I do think that the double nest was working out better. Uh, I think if maybe they hadn't, at the end, if they hadn't been so reckless, they probably could have taken that. Mm -hmm. A lot of unsafe... Uh, PK Thunder charges. Yeah. Got punished. <laughs> Alex went for a lot of PK Thunder hits there, but uh, ended up costing him. And he has teammate a few times as well, not with the charge, but just the ball. Yeah, it looks like they agree with me as we're going right back. Just need to focus on a few gameplay issues and they'll be fine. We're getting that salty run back on a salty Smashable. Run back. <laughs> Smashable, always a good stage. Starting out even here, Alex got kind of bopped, so he's already at high percentage. Tone was not in position to get that combo. 
And there's the finishing touch combo once again. Unfortunate. Whoa. Oh, he wanted the PK fire trap into the bat. They're both throwing out bats now. Sam was looking for an up smash off that platform, but it didn't get the throw confirmed. Alex still has all three stocks, so if he can hold on to it, that'd be good for Yellow Team. And he just needs one back throw on uh, Sheik. Mm -hmm. Sam again hit with the dash attack after missing that pivot grab. And right as I say that, getting that pivot grab. Good combo. Just need to finish. Uh, Sammy is stock quick and they'll have a nice lead. Mm -hmm. Same goes for Buster's Eliminated with Cholin though. Yeah. He's sitting out a solid one. Oh. oh, unfortunate. I'm not sure if that was poor DI or if the uh, player just killed there. Another solid, uh, is that a back throw to a finishing touch? What? Is that a back throw to finishing touch? Yeah. Yeah. Poor throw or back throw works for Sheik. Mm -hmm. uh, they both have pretty good angles for Clouds. Uh, down B. And Sammy's still stubbornly holding on to the stock. Mm -hmm. He's just throwing those, uh, those uh, up airs out and try and zone them. And here comes Sheik combos. And that's... that's oh, oh, the needle, the needle was saved. Save. Very smart by Daniel. That's some good team play. And... It Oh, I thought he would have sacrificed the stock, but uh, host remain on stage. Sammy. Uses uppers to keep Chon off the stage, and now it's a 1v2, but Chon's going to take the stock. And Sammy still has his limit. This is a commanding lead from Red Team now. They're really going to have to bring it back here. Hmm. Alright, there's one. Sammy finally loses his first stock. It's not looking too good for Dumper. The crowd's up here just so good against Ness in the air. Mm -hmm. It's just looking really grim for Yellow Team right now. I'm not sure what they can do. Oh, ooh, <laughs> needle in the grab. Needle in the grab. <laughs> I haven't seen that. Too bad. Too bad he wasn't a higher percent. Oh, could they zone him out? Oh, all right. They got the gimp on Cloud. All right. This is doable. And just some angriness is Oh, smart from Knox to stay in the air with his teammate to Oh, but he can't cover him that time, unfortunately. Alright, this is gonna be tough. And as I say that, mm -hmm. it's gonna be over. The potential is there, but it's just too much percent to get past. Yep, it was just too far too late or too little too late, excuse me. And Buster's Unlimited takes that game. Moving on to grand finals? I'm not sure. I'm assuming I haven't, I haven't looked at the bracket. I'm assuming. <laughs> 